Marvis Frazier. From Marvis, trained by his father, former champion Joe Frazier, it was to be his first and only attempt to win back his father's old title. Any questions for Mr. Holmes' corner? Okay, let's get it on. Well, that's fighting talk. And that's Larry Holmes' wife. Las Vegas, 25th of November, 1983. So there, a chance or not for Marvis Fraser, is he? Fraser, of course, with only 10 fights, but has been around the hard-bitten gymnasiums of the world, boxed in the top American. Just look at this for a show-off at the start then by Marvis Frazier. Trying to show contempt for home three minutes every round. By that he means he's got to pitch in punches and try and slow Holmes down, who he reckons is now reduced to spasms of punching during the round to save his strength. City, he didn't have him down. Oh! The long right hand, well, look at that. He's been down as an amateur, Marvis Fraser, but this is the first time as a pro. He's not in control of his legs. He measured that right hand, and there's the fighting. What he can say, what can he say? But look out, here he comes with the next punch. And he really could do with those seconds ticking away fast round. He shouldn't have dropped his hands. And Holmes warned everybody that he would have to put the kid in his place. And it looks as though this could... Many people thought it was. Really put him, Gun Frazier, in trouble there. Will he get over this first round? The gun shield comes flying out. Bill Slane, the referee, hopefully giving him every chance, but it's all one way now, and he stopped it in the opening round. Which, a few seconds to go, three seconds probably, to the end of the first round. There's Holmes' his wife, and there's Joe saying to the son, OK, kid, I know what that's all about. It's just no doubt that the father's judgment was in serious doubt there and obviously very wrong because this is how Holmes said he would have to deal he said in the gym I'm gonna get no pleasure out of beating him up and it looks a very moving moment there between fighters and considering he got about two and a half million dollars for that he plays the long right hand you'd really almost telegraphed and there was no way that Fraser could keep in control there just look at he's holding the arms too low right through the middle really like a lance. It was a devastating right hand punch. So that's where he was waving the punches then at Fraser. A little bit of Ali show off there. And just clubbing him at will and calling the referee in Mills Lane and clipping him there. It, that really is back to the old Jack Johnson days. Punishing his man and showing mercy at the same time. But he had to get on with the business. That's what the champions are all about. This really is a tough game. And it went on, for me, a dozen punches too long. And the district attorney referee from Nevada, there he is, and about time.